two, three. Mimi, aka the Piscean Seer, and this is one of your daily collective readings, okay? Like and subscribe if you get anything out of this. Thank you to those of you who do like, subscribe, and comment. It is greatly, greatly loved and appreciated, okay? Um, God, Archangels, Ancestors, Ascended Masters, all beings of light only, you're welcome into this reading. Please give the Piscean Seer Collective the best and most accurate information for them at this time. Whew kind of a mouthful sometimes okay so um i'm using my notes my channel notes today okay so it says if they survive that shooting they must be godly okay so somebody you could have literally survived a shooting okay where somebody was trying to take you out but i really get like metaphorical shots okay somebody's always i mean not metaphor metaphorical i guess more um I don't know spirit said like underhanded you know like kind of like behind your back type of shots you know somebody's always trying to work against you okay all the time like they don't like you they don't want to see you succeed they don't want to see you go nowhere better they don't like what you're talking about they don't like the transition that you made from the rough waters over there with them they want to see you struggling and down and you know feeling sorry for them and yourself okay they don't like that you are healing and that you are going toward the sun okay towards a brighter way of thinking and being but um there's nothing but good news coming to you okay you've been so faithful okay but um, also with the page, I get like very immature energy, okay? These people are just really, really immature. They just really, truly don't understand this whole divinity thing at all. They just don't. But they know they want to claim it, you know? They know they want to act like the star like you, okay? But they're not the star. We got Aquarius, Sagittarius. Is that Sagittarius? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it is um the emperor okay so you could be in this emperor energy really have your um stability and structure you know you've built your foundation okay um you've been being very logical very practical very um you know <laughs> intuitive about the moves that you're making in your life right now okay um, and you're dealing with people who are very arrogant. Okay, look, it says arrogant, reckless, hyperactive, daredevil, overly confident, loud show off. Okay, one who promises much but does not deliver. Okay, people are mad because they talk a good game. You know, they talk that shit like they can deliver what you can deliver. But when it comes time to deliver, they ain't never delivering. Okay, and that's why you're going to get this ultimate happiness. Okay, that's why you deserve this. Not to look. <laughs> okay the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles coming out together okay fire and these people ain't getting nothing but judgment okay and you know exactly who these people are and exactly what they've been up to okay you also got um what is that <laughs> i don't know why i can't hold on to these damn signs for nothing okay it's pisces um virgo i just don't want to miss anything okay and yeah Sagittarius and Aquarius that's all that I was really getting okay but you know everything that's going on okay you've seen through all of these illusions okay you always see the shit coming okay you <laughs> with this <laughs> with this three of wands and the devil okay you always see the bullshit coming okay these people are always constantly making a choice okay when they have a choice do they want to try to build up their own life you know what i'm saying and get their own cup to outpour you know so they can finally win something because all they're doing is losing trying to fuck with you 
they always choose to come over there and fuck with you, okay? Um, you could have some sort of new job, okay? And these people are around trying to ca cause conflict, okay? They don't want to see you have this wish fulfillment, okay? Even though they see how hard you've been working on building this shit, okay? Nobody's supporting you. Nobody don't want to have nothing to do with it. Fine, okay? Spirit's saying keep on standing your ground, okay? Keep on having fun, basking in the, in the knowledge that you have all of the choices that you want to make. But let me stop rambling on. Okay, let me stop rambling on because there's a lot of notes with this message, okay? Um, it says, you accepted Christ's light, okay? You act with wisdom and loving compassion. And these people just don't understand that I shuffled this deck for no reason because I'm done with it. Which tells me that you have changed your perspective, okay? You've changed your perspective and these people just really don't understand that, you know? They're always, look, you have a big divine destiny to fulfill okay and they don't have the balls nor the power the personal power that it takes to stop you to derail you okay it don't matter what's living in a body because they show damn show are not in a body alone okay um this could be someone who you spent a lot of time like i'm really getting like a family type of vibe okay you spent a lot of time laughing and you know being happy with this person okay whenever you get good luck or good things happening with you you want to share okay which is why i'm getting the family thing okay you always wanted to share and give to these people okay it says passion flower excuse me jesus is scourging whip someone as a punishment because great cause great suffering too okay so all they ever wanted to do was cause you this great suffering just because you're trying to move on you know and live a brighter more happy and fulfilled type of life okay because you are living in your truth okay there's somebody in your family who's forged your documents okay like they could have lived with you okay they stole your shit um cleanse your energy often okay um whenever your intuition gives you the need to do so okay because they're doing a lot of voodoo on you at this time <laughs> gratitude spirit i'm not laughing at the voodoo i'm laughing at how that card just came right up <laughs> okay um they're doing a whole lot of they want to do like crying to you okay they want you to have nothing that's what they want they want to take your ten of pentacles because bitches be hating period that's simple the only reason why they just hate you they always have okay this so it's like um you were always very nurturing and bonding okay um emotional stability for these people okay and um people could have even like this could be someone you were really close to okay someone that your friend looked at as like um because the hand flower is known as the devil's hand okay could be someone who um always wants to borrow your jewelry okay is what i'm getting from this bracelet because um there's a hand flower which is a bracelet and the devil's hand, which is an actual flower, okay? It says everyone is deserving of forgiveness, okay? So um, don't be afraid to forgive these people. That's definitely what you need to do, okay? Because um, don't worry, this is gonna get better. <laughs> this, this is gonna get better, okay? We're not gonna be on this the entire time, but I think Spirit is saying it's very important to talk about where you've been, so we can talk about where you're gonna go, okay? So let me get this other card. It says trying to see to use your gifts to manipulate you okay so these people could even be trying to act like um you know they want you to help them some type of way you know or like even like they're trying to understand themselves you know they want to learn their own gifts and this and this and that but they're just trying to use the information that they get from you to manipulate you okay this could be this could even be your mom okay it says xenx ambient zombie mom you could have a mother who self-medicates all the time. I heard her drinks a lot, okay? It says, dear future, I'm ready, okay? You ready like SpongeBob, okay? And God got your back the whole way with this Psalms 9111. It says, he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all ways, okay? So you're guarded and you're protected and you're guided, you know? No matter how much these people try to dim your light, you're always gonna keep on going, okay? <laughs> so, um, you're, you could have the first or last initials m p c b a j or k okay um or they could the people who's hating on you um then you got peacock there's a lot of animals okay you have a lot of animal guides okay um feel free to look into any of these things that i bring up okay <laughs> um so there's the peacock um you have this unique beauty and strength about you okay this confidence and this divinity that shines from the inside out okay um 
rose um you could be going towards a love connection okay it says romance love beauty and courage it says a thornless red rose means love at first sight okay so somebody could be about to see you and fall in love at first sight with you okay those who profit by wisdom become god's friend okay so you are a friend of god that is why you are protected because you deliver his word for him in some type of way okay you're not afraid to talk about what you believe in okay and really share that with others try to get as much of the truth out into the streets as you can okay um love heals it keeps you strong okay oh shit these people around you they don't really love you okay they don't really care about you they're just in it for whatever like watch that i made a video the other day about um some people are just around for the clout okay you might feel like you don't have any clout yet but this year this year that just passed or this year coming up you made some major changes okay and you also set up these boundaries okay and there's some bitches out here getting voodoo it says three skeletons discovered in arizona it says carnivore loose jaws okay so people got your name in their mouth they keep on talking and shit but um they can't kill with their claws arms and legs okay they they scavenge carcasses okay they're bottom feeders they get what they can get um, and you're the most, you're like the most mixed up non-delinquent on the block, you know, because you're not really participating. You know for a fact that um, divine is your source, okay? The divine is your source. They tell you everything that you need to hear. They tell you how to act, okay? Um, spirit. So they're saying it's okay for you to feel safe. This says feeling safe. You could be feeling really, really safe, even though, you know, technically you, you are always in danger because there's always someone who wants to you know snuff out the, the light of a divine one okay but you're always protected for that very same reason okay um this says i'm gonna get the last one and i wrote laugh next to it okay so you're about to get the last laugh also these people spend a lot of time laughing behind your back gossiping about whatever it is that you're doing okay whatever you're putting your time into they think it's a game Ooh. Stop. Look at this gossip. Why, why did gossip come right out, okay? Um, yeah, yeah. And it says Messiah right here. Let me see. Oh, I lost it. It's okay. Um, so, awakens consideration for the feelings of others, honor, and trust, okay? Thrives on the power of passing on private or secret information, betraying confidences, okay? So, this is what they do. They thrive on talking about you, okay? Trying to make you look like you ain't shit. Trying to make you look bad, okay? They networking against you, okay? Like a motherfucker. It says, um... You enhance unity through the sharing of information and engender social awareness and empathy, okay? While these people convey information only for personal gain and to spread fear and falsehood, okay? So there's a lot of lying going on with these with this gossip that they're spreading around, okay? Um, but <laughs> the harpoon is next, okay? The harpoon um when i when i looked it up i got um the old man in the sea by ernest Hemingway. okay you could like ernest Hemingway. okay that could be something that you have read before okay it says the power of the fisherman in the sea teaches a man to fish okay and then beggar came out okay because um you know you teach a man you give a man fish he eats for a day you teach a man to fish and he eats for life okay spirit has taught you how to fish and these people they don't know how to fish yet okay they barely they barely know how to fucking swim okay it says confronts empowerment at the level of physical survival awakens the spiritual authority of humility compassion and self-esteem okay this is what you have done within yourself okay when you beg you beg god you beg to you beg to spirit you know where your things come from and you're grateful and you know when it's time to ask for something and when it's time to just wait on god to move okay um and these people are dependent on others okay to the exclusion of effort because they exclude effort in their lives. They're not putting effort toward doing anything bigger or better. But they got nothing but foul, scaling shit to say about you behind your back. You know, when all they have to really do is worry about their fucking self. Um, it says, simply the loss of harpoon symbolizes the loss of power of Santiago amidst the sea and the strength. Okay. So they have lost their power against against your your sea you know your strength you have total control of your sea okay of the 
of your waters, of your emotions, okay? You're not jealous. You're not a hater, okay? You only want to see people do the best, okay? You have the Midas. <laughs> it says Midas, okay? Entrepreneurial or creative ability to turn anything into gold, delight in sharing life's riches, okay? While these people, on the other hand, they're very stingy, okay? When they do get money, they hoard that money. They could uh, disappear with their money when they get money and then come back broke, okay? They have an obsessive fear of losing it says obsessive fear of losing their wealth, okay? Um, mediator. Um, also, harpoons are used in marine hunting to catch and injure large fish in marine life, okay? So, I, when I looked up the definition, um, the example was whales, okay? It says whales represent magnificence, communication, music, protection, gratitude, wisdom, transformation, and psychic abilities, okay? You have spirit guiding you, okay? Um, spirits giving, it says you have a gift for negotiation, fairness, and strategy in personal and professional life. Respect for both sides of an argument, okay? So these people cannot, cannot get you out of character like they really hope that they would because you're too like ethical, you know, you don't really have time for that bullshit and you're not going to negotiate with these bitches about nothing that's stupid you know what I'm saying um it says and these people whenever they come trying to do something you know or trying to like they might come and act like they're doing something for you you know but really there's an ulterior motive okay or hidden agenda either personally or professionally um it says there's 90 species of whales okay whales live in every ocean <laughs> So it's like, it doesn't matter where you go. There's always going to be um, some type of hater there. You know what I'm saying? I mean, <clears throat> there's always going to be some type of hater. There, there's all types of species of hater around here, okay? You're always going to run into one. Make sure you keep your harpoon strapped, okay? So um, next, it was Psalms 18.6. In distress, I call upon the Lord. I, in distress, I called upon the Lord and cried unto my God. He heard my voice out of his temple and my cry came before him, even into his ears. Okay. It says companion. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. So God is your companion. Okay. Um, you're very loyal to God. Okay. You're very tenacious about the word of God and you're not, a, you're not selfish at all. Okay. And these people have betrayed you by misusing your confidence. Okay. And also there, there's a loss of their personal identities. Okay. They don't know who they are anymore because they have fucked with you. It's their karma to start slowly forgetting you know, anything that they even wanted to do and anything they think they finna start trying to build with your name and their mouth in a faulty way is gonna fall because their foundation is built on sand. They couldn't build nothing good if they wanted to, okay? So next was the pumpkin, okay? Gratitude, generos generosity, harvest, and abundance. These people can like smell your abundance coming, okay? My nose is running. These people could be, your spirit team could have these people like, um, on the run, you know, kind of avoiding you, maybe not saying shit. Um, it says guide represents the nature of divine, of the divine in life and in yourself. Okay. Um, and these people, they're placing financial gain and control over imparting spiritual insight. Okay. They don't, they don't want to listen to the guys that they had. Okay. Cause the guides, um, your guides will abandon you or their guides are, you know, low vibrational guides. If they do have guides, um, it says each pumpkin is packed full of seeds that will go on to make more pumpkins. Okay. So you always going to be able to make more pumpkins because you're full of seeds. You're full of the divine wisdom. Okay. Nobody can stop you from what you're doing and they really wish they could. Okay. So, um, the angel number 88, um, so, these people, they incessantly, it says incessant, what happens regularly without implying always or uninterruptedly, okay, in a way that is without pause or interruption. So these people, this is how much they talk about you and, you know, um, work against you, like all the time, like un it's all always, all the time, incessantly. Um, it says abundance and wealth, everything you wish will come true as long as you are connected to the self and divine and following guidance. Okay. Um, and then mentor came out. Okay. You probably were supposed to be a mentor to these people at first, 
but um, they have totally lost out on that, okay? Um, so it says, passing on wisdom and refining a student's character, okay? Um, these people, it says, the shadow attributes, inability to allow the student to move on to the role of master, imparting false instruction, okay? So they could even be, um, like, I really heard, like, repeating, repeating advice. Like, if you give advice of some kind, they go and they repeat the advice. This, <laughs> so um, number 414 is next, okay? It's, which says more tolerable, okay? Um, positive changes, okay? Angels wish to support you as long as you preserve and work toward your goals, okay? And then next it says ride the wave, okay? So these shapeshifters, okay? These shapeshifters is out here trying to ride your wave, okay? You are a shapeshifter too, but you do it from a light you are the light attributes okay and they are the dark straight up with this it says um light attributes skill at navigating through different levels of consciousness ability to see the potential in everything and they are projecting any image that serves your personal agenda in the moment okay so they're only showing you whatever face they think you want to see excuse me so that they can seem authentic okay and next um, was the crab, okay? The crab is a source of wisdom and adaptability, okay? Growth and resourcefulness. That is you. You always growing and shifting and changing way better than these bitches ever could do, you know? And you're doing it. You do it from an honest place, okay? Look at the priest. It says... Um, Facilitate spiritual commitment serves as a channel of spiritual energy, okay? So you could be your, your channel, okay? <laughs> um, and these people, they violate the trust of the spiritual co community, seduced by their own spiritual role. You know, these people, they're operating out of their ego. They think that they're so much better than others, you know? Like, they are never going to have to answer to God and... I don't know, some of them in some sick, twisted way even think that they're doing God's work in some type of way, you know, like they've convinced themselves that whatever it is that you believe in, it's evil and they got to stop you, sinner. <laughs> okay, whoa. <laughs> um, addict, okay, this person could be an addict, okay, comprises integrity and honesty, allows an addictive pattern to have authority over their inner spirit, okay, and you could have been an addict before, okay, but you have learned to um recognize and confront addictive behaviors okay so that's the difference between the two of you you know because people always I, I get the feeling that they're like oh well you know well they used to do this and they used to do that like they always talking about some old shit that you used to do when they around talking about you okay um next was the surfboard okay you could have dreamt that you were surfing or dreamt about a surfboard um, it says something or someone you are using to survive on emotionally turbulent moments, okay? Or they could be, they could have dreamt about a, <laughs> they could have been dreamt about a surfboard, okay? Because they're trying to survive on you. They're trying to use your emotions against you, okay? Look, it says child nature, okay? Because they're immature, they are in a codependent energy, okay? They have a tendency to abuse animals and people and the environment, like they probably litter all the time. Um, you have this friendships with animals and communication with nature spirits, okay? You probably stay very grounded, and that's great. I didn't know we was going to talk about these other people so much. <laughs> okay, so um, it says surfboards are relatively light but strong enough to support an individual standing on them while riding an ocean wave, okay? So it's like, you you strong enough to carry this whole shit on your back, you feel me? But bitches can't, oh, look at this with the detective, okay? Bitches can't stay out your business long enough for you to go and do anything. These people are watching you, okay? Um, they're vo doing voyeurism is what it says, falsifying information, okay? So they're watching you, watching what you do, okay? This could be somebody who lives very close to you, okay? Or even lives in your house. They watching you get gathering all your information and then going to go report that shit to somebody else who wants to know your business. So clearly they're not working alone or I wouldn't have said that, okay? Um, I hear an ex, okay, relatively light, but sh like an ex person, they're talking to your ex or something, okay, look at, and they're doing all of this magic, okay, misusing their power and knowledge that come through spiritual practices, okay, 
Um, but you have great powers of observation and intuition, okay? So um, you find out the tr any truth that you desire to seek out, okay? There is no fooling you, no tricking you. You are truly divine and they don't understand that. They think that they're better than you. They've convinced themselves that, oh no, I'm the better choice. You know, that's what they're telling all your friends too behind your back being a real martyr look <laughs> walking around in self-pity okay trying to convince everyone that you did something wrong to them when really they just a shitty person okay and you're learning to learning um the transcendent nature of service to oneself or to another cause okay or to others okay um you could be um of hawaiian descent okay it says um ancient hawaiians made surfboards from koa from the local koa trees okay koa symbolizes strength and courage koa means warrior okay so you could have been going through a lot of spiritual war with these people a lot of war in the dream states okay um it says go to it's the go-to wood in making of many ancient canoes and surfboards okay myrrh was next okay um and it's i wrote kingly status okay so you are of kingly status you're divine look at this it's a prince <laughs> gratitude spirit i love them um it's a, so you're um romantic and charming and you have this potential to you know wield the greatest power okay and people know that about you and they're trying to use the power for self what is it? Arrange diesement? Arrange dies arrange yes, I guess. Okay. Um, palm trees was next, okay? So you are going to be victorious, okay? You are going to be triumphant. And these people are out here looking like fools, okay? But not only that, you chose the fool journey, okay? To fearlessly reveal your emotions and help people laugh at absurdity and hypocrisy, okay? <laughs> Which is my kind of shit, right? Because this is exactly what I'm doing, okay? And these people use humor to wound rather than to liberate okay um they use humor to deny their own deep emotional issues and truths inside of them look at this an exorcist these bitches need an exorcist Woo! it says fear of facing your own demons it says slave okay um these people are giving their willpower to an external authority out of fear of making their own choices okay and you, you're surrendering your power to the divine with complete trust, you know, because you are the child divine, okay? You are the child magical, okay? It says, innocence, purity, redemption suggests a special connection with the divine. Seeing the potential for sacred beauty in all things, the belief that everything is possible, okay? While these people are operating in pessimism and depression and disbelief and miracles, okay? Believing that energy and action are not required for growth. Like, they could just sit around and, like, they just gonna hit it rich, you know, off doing nothing, okay? It says, um, they assume that they will be rescued, that um that the rescued will reciprocate and keeps the rescued ones needy okay you provide strength and support to others in crisis and act out of love with no expectation of reward and that's why they're trying to latch on to you to attach to you because if they can present as somebody who's trying to learn from you and trying to grow from the things that you're saying then they can slide under the radar you know and get away with keep doing the scandalous shit that they're doing okay trying to suck up um all of your energy and all of your power that um they can't even handle okay so what's next um it says we're gonna be zooted ass people in this place <laughs> it says newbies too okay you could be new to this just because you're new to this doesn't mean anything okay you could have made, done a lot of spiritual growth that most spiritual people um could get hung up on you know you could have hopped through those things quite easily because you were always meant to do this okay you've been training to do this for lifetimes is what spirit said um sun represents life but it's also known to typify energy power positivity and clarity a natural force outside of our control okay so there's um natural forces Woo! the i am presence okay there are natural forces outside of um your control that are guiding you through this life that are the reason that you are blessed okay it says light body ascent ascension assessing the divine within okay the divine is always within you period did i skip a whole page i totally did oh that's a lot okay 
Um, so, damn it. Let me get the tablet. Let me get the tablet, because we we're going to have to do this right. It says hula hoop scratch offs. Okay, this person could like to gamble a lot, or you could like to gamble. Dang, I thought I was on top of it because I did my little notes last night, but I skipped a page somehow. Okay, I guess y'all like to see me doing stuff. <laughs> This says Shambhala initiations, retreating to recharge, trusting in the process, okay, Dharma. So really you're retreating to recharge and someone's trying to come in, you know, look at this card. They're trying to push this addict is trying to push their way into your energy, okay, and somehow trick you into trusting them, you know, and, you know, um, ignoring everything that you've learned about them so that you will um, be willing to take care of them and provide for them in some type of way. And it's like, no, bitch, I'm not, no. Like, if you want to be provided for, you need to talk to God just like I had to, okay? Your name could be Kelsey or Kelly, or they, their names could be Kelsey or Kelly or something that starts with a K, too. Hula hoop. Okay, so it says the hoop is symbolic of the never ending circle of life. Okay, it has no beginning and no end. Okay, <laughs> so I'm really getting like there's no beginning and no end to these people's. Um, what is that word I'm looking for? To these people's. Um, it's not like an assault. I mean, I, it is kind of an assault, but they're just like, they want your abundance, okay? They want your downloads. They want your regeneration. They want your success. They want to be you, to be standing where you are. And with this scratch offs, they're willing to gamble their life and everything that they have on it, okay? They're willing to gamble everything to take your shit. And, and if they got to take your life, <laughs> they think they have the power to do that. They think they can, they have the power to take your life. They don't have the fucking power to take your life. <laughs> it's outrageous. Um, I just, I just typed the wrong thing. Okay. And it showed me a little green pill. Somebody could be using little green pills to like poison people to put in people's drinks. Okay. Or they could like to pop X. It looked like X. Oh shit! I typed green again. Let me see, cause it keeps. It keep, I keep pulling it up. Um, it says, "Hyosisamine sulfate." It doesn't say what it's for. It don't say what it's for. Anyways. Okay, so 40 means sacred or holy, okay? Properly different. Holy for the believer, okay? Likeness of nature with the Lord, okay? That's you. That's what, that's that's you. <laughs> that's why you have this abundance, okay? You get all these downloads and you get all these regeneration cuz you are truly walking around in likeness of the Lord, okay? Like you embrace your divinity. You recognize you're one with everyone and everything. You don't use people or try to get over on people, okay? Your angels are reminding you that you are safe, well protected, and love, okay? Your guardian angels are near. And all you have to do is reach out and talk to them, okay? Ask them for your help, okay? New beginnings and fresh starts are ahead for you. Um, keep up the great work you've been doing, okay? The hard work. You have been toiling at this lifetime is going to pay off. The heart of source, all encompassing love, unconditional acceptance and serenity, okay? So I said all encompassing love, unconditional acceptance and serenity because the video started over and it makes me get quiet before it actually cuts me off, okay? So um, you've already sealed this deal that you made with spirit, it says, it says you and I have got some unfinished business, okay? So um, you've got some unfinished business with spirit, but also somebody feels like they have unfinished business with you, okay? They want to 
destroy your sacred inner place okay they could be attacking your sacral chakra okay um they don't like your tender your um tenderness and sensuality okay um they could have had people um be a more attracted to you than them in the past maybe their exes okay um they're they're always trying to manifest a life with you okay damn it <laughs> they're always trying to but they can't catch you okay you see how i just tried to catch that but i couldn't catch it and i was like damn it that's how they like that's how they are every time you figure out what they're up to okay every time you put them on blast or say something you know to point out their atomic habits that they're always um at operating in it, it really fucks them up, okay? And they're really starting to regret the way that they're treating you because they're starting to see, okay, you're not the small prey that they thought you were. They, It's hard. It's going to be harder to take you out, okay? It's because you answered your call, okay? It's your time to shine. There's nothing nobody can do to shut you down or stop you in any way, okay? It says... Here comes the moment I've been praying for, okay? So the moment you've been praying for is coming to you very soon. Sooner than you think it is, is what I heard, okay? All right. Yeah, look at this. Earth star activation, anchoring grounded action, Isis energy, okay? So Isis energy is the energy of unconditional love. You're in the you're in this real strong energy of unconditional love, you know. And there's nobody can fuck with that, okay? It says um you can't you can run, but you can't hide. It's going down tonight, okay? So could be something happening for somebody. I mean, to somebody tonight. I, um, or they could be trying to, trying to plan something. It's like every night they trying to plan, they always trying to plan something on you. Okay. But they refuse to wake up and look in the mirror and see that, um, <laughs> look at wake up <laughs> and look in the mirror. Okay. They refuse to wake up and look in the mirror. They keep like, uh, fucking grape stomping. Okay. Trying to always like beat a dead horse is what I'm hearing. Um, see them symbolism says, um, that personal personified female spirits of the sea, which were worshipped as the divinities of the sea. Okay, so somebody could really look at you as like, you know, the true personification of feminine energy. Okay, like you were really you willing to cook and clean and do all of that. You know, someone's looking at you like you're a wife, you're a catch. Excuse me. And even if this is the person that don't like you, okay, they see a lot of things about you that they do like that they would like to imitate you. But if they could get rid of you and just be you, you know, their best version of you, then they feel like they would be winning when all they have to really do is just be the best, best version of themselves, okay? It says, so rabbit symbolism says, almost always symbolize prosperity abundance good luck and fertility unlike many other animals which have different meanings in different cultures rabbit symbolism is consistent okay so you're very consistent no matter what it says rabbits are springtime animals symbolic of fruitfulness and renewal okay so something um very big significant could be happening for you in the springtime okay around like april may ish it says I'm just a bachelor looking for a partner, okay? Womb full. <laughs> okay, so um, this person could be always looking for some sort of partner, you know? It's like this is how many people and energies have been inside of them. Like, it's like they're holding it in, though, you know what I mean? It's not like a stab at anyone, you know, who's ever been promiscuous or ever, you know, been out there, you know? You know, a lot of that stuff comes with just, you know, being young and really trying to enjoy your life and not to mention all of the magic and bullshit people do on you. You know what I mean? Throughout the whole thing, like, whew, okay. So now we're at the murdered palm trees, okay? And sun, okay? The sun represents life and it's also known to typify energy, power, positivity, and um clarity okay so you're seeing clearer than you've ever seen it says a natural force outside of our control that's when the i am presence came out okay archangel of mental makeovers okay so um there's let me see let me see what does it say in the book all right i'm making a pretty good time if i do say so myself 
Okay. So the Archangel of Mental Makeovers is Archangel Uriel, okay? Um, it says, if your thoughts are driving you crazy, Archangel Uriel is about to help you with a mental makeover. Divine has a few ideas up its sleeve. Also, this person could be um, like projecting thoughts at you, okay? Like really trying to make you feel insecure. They want you to feel like you don't look that cute and all types of shit. Now, you look good as fuck, okay? You shining, you popping, and they mad, <laughs> okay? Archangel Uriel is known for carrying a torch. In this case, he's using a blowtorch to create new pathways in your thinking. It may seem like you're really working your problem over with your brain, but your thoughts are actually working you over. That's why the Archangel of the Mental Makeover has arrived on the scene. He has seen your thinking patterns. You may have been tricked into thinking you have done some good reasoning, but... Uriel believes you are following a path into a mental maze. Those spotlights he is shining are going to reveal new magical answers to some very old mental questions, okay? You may find yourself having new thoughts that seem to come out of nowhere. Uriel holds a torch of divine truth. God has plenty of imagination and humor to untangle your mental maze, okay? Uriel is his messenger when it comes to new thinking. You know how they have those giant spotlights outside a movie premiere? Well, these spotlights tell you Uriel has arrived to help you with some new ideas. Welcome to your mental makeover, okay? because you could have been wondering like what the fuck is up with this person you know why are they always acting like that they always acting weird always acting like they don't like me you know um but when they think when something's going good you know then they want to come around you know they don't like you but they like your flavorful future okay they like all of the options and opportunities you just you being you having some status would get them okay like i said they're just around like that that reading i did they just here for the snacks okay it says illuminates the world around us okay which is what the sun does and that's what you do you you illuminate the world around you okay look interview with a psychic okay <laughs> okay you illuminate the world around you um you you talking to you is like talking to a psychic okay um we probably would have a great conversation <laughs> okay it says sustains many essential ecosystems okay so while these people are trying to take you out okay they don't realize that you are the thing that is sustaining this ecosystem if you get removed karma gonna fold in on these bitches okay um it says power up okay make sure that you're getting your rest that you're powering up but also they do things to your sleep patterns to try to keep you from being at your best okay um oh i seen it says catfish commercial while taking these notes i don't know why why did i write that catfish catfish okay somebody's trying to catfish you that's why I wrote that, okay? Some kitchen witch is, is trying to catfish you and play games with you, okay? Um, could be someone who, you know, like you share food with, okay? You share a space with this person. It says friendly skies. So look to the sky for your friends because they show the hell ain't in front of you, okay? Mushrooms represent good health and fertility, okay? Um, they also represent the freedom you have afforded yourself by doing the work, okay? Spirit is illuminating a culmination of growth in your life at this moment okay you about to blow up like three times the size that you are right now <laughs> i heard even more okay um spirit oh wait the, this moment is both a triumphant both a triumphant ending and a critical new beginning okay mushrooms grow in wet dark places okay so you had to go and do these tangles with all of these vampires okay you know you know had to two-step all around so you could grow in these wet dark places and really be able to recognize that shit for what it is okay let's see what is it saying oh also mushrooms Represents stability and safety, meditation and self-reflection, wealth and abundance, magic and mystery, okay? Nothing but good vibrations coming to you, okay? You are vibrating on a very angelic frequency, and that's fire, okay? You you kicking up this fairy dust out here, okay? <laughs> it says, this one says, kick it up, okay? And this one says, fairy dust, okay? First things first, okay? You really um, paying attention to yourself, okay? Putting yourself and your personal property first. You're not forgetting to play okay 
and these people are mad because you won't you won't um entertain whoever it is that you let go already that they still entertaining okay because your angels direct dialed in that shit that that was some bullshit okay okay they dialed it right in right in right on down to you okay dropped you a download okay you are in for nothing but luck and prosperity okay these nobody's ever gonna win <laughs> not anyone who's trying to stop the will of god no and what kind of crazy person would really try that shit anyway okay these bitches do not like how high your vibe is that really that really grinds their gears okay they may watch family guy it says um that elephants use their mighty strength to remove obstacles and negativity okay wisdom long life memory and vitality okay you're about to start remembering who you are okay and you're gonna speak up about that shit because it's gonna piss you off all right but you got to do it when spirit allows you to do it okay you realized that you were the alchemist the entire time you know and so these people i'm not gonna say they figured it out too because if they're your family they knew already okay it says wisdom long life memory and vitality next it says giraffe okay you're very unique okay um you're very unique and you take pride in the things that you do, okay? You could be um, a reader of some sort, okay? You could reveal the secrets of others to help the collective, okay? You could be very spiritual, very into your spirituality, very, uh, you know, crystal, um, sage, you know, herb oriented, or you, you need to be, it will help you, okay? You carry an aura of calmness and tranquility about you and that's why people wanna be around you, you know? They really love the feeling that comes, like when you are in this creative energy, people love the way that that, that energy that bounces off your aura mm, is fucking delicious to them, okay? And that's why they're running into storms because they, don't, they just wanna eat you. They don't wanna learn from you or really help you to get anywhere in life, okay? Um... So it says, represents our ability to stand out from the crowd, sincerity and kindness, okay? That's why you get whatever you desire because you're very sincere about who you are and the way that you stand out. It says the world is a, is a better place when you have this animal as a guide, a swordfish, okay? Swordfish represents courage and passion. Um, this spirit animal sees the fear of change in your heart. You may worry over the future so much that you miss the present, okay? So don't be worried, okay? Don't be worried about the future. That's where your faith comes in, okay? Once you um, really awaken, it says the sacred lust, okay? But I'm really getting like, you know, sacred information from these hieroglyphs back here, you know? He's got this staff, okay? She's got the moon on her head, you know? She's very balanced, okay? She got the snake in one hand and the, the flower in the other, you know? She's totally in control and she's standing on the back of a lion, you know? And these people are right here at her beck and call, you know, to do whatever it is that she needs them to do, to do when she needs them to do it, okay? And that's that's how, how your spirit um, team is is it says if you dream of a of a um what is this of a swordfish okay if you dream of a swordfish um it could be a sign that you need to instill more enjoyment and laughter into your life enjoy the moment and little things of true value okay find the strength and courage in the little things that you cannot buy okay that's where you get it from it says a symbol of spiritual welfare and unclean spirits and those who abstain okay so you could be abstaining from sex these people could be trying to set you up with someone just so they can fill you with the nastiness okay you know or put their nastiness on you all right um this your your ancestors and guys are enraged about this they are not with that they don't like that okay <laughs> um so next oh a sagittarius plus a rooster okay so if you're a sagittarius and you were born in the year of the rooster okay that means that's um swordfish energy okay i don't know that's for somebody frequently found basking at the surface of the ocean and prefer to live by their own philosophies okay so you don't you don't do what other people say you know you don't do what's cool because you are divine okay you are of divine lineage you know you're you're here to be a leader okay you're here to lead others and show others the right way so you don't really second guess yourself too much all right let's use the unicorn cards 
so it says freak um it says prefer to be alone or separated by 33 feet from other swordfish okay 33 represents the life path three balance creativity communication boundaries okay and all it, it means come come now okay or calling okay you you receive the calling from spirit okay you are a motherfucking conqueror <laughs> It says you're a motherfucking conqueror. Life is going to get hard sometimes, so get your fucking shit together and stand the fuck up. You are a fucking volcano, not a damn anthill. Anthills get walked on and crushed. Volcanoes conquer cities and build islands out of ashes. Nobody fucks with volcanoes, okay? So these people is really finna get it, okay? <laughs> um, things are really finna erupt in a nasty way in their life, okay? It says... Um, that uh, swordfish can reach speeds of almost 110 kilometers an hour, okay? Um, the number 110 represents God force energy, okay? A powerful energy of motivation and achieving goals and aspirations, okay? And it also represents immortality that number it says be a unicorn not a twatapus okay we all have those days where we feel like being a little down but suck it up buttercup nobody likes a twatty twatapus be the damn unicorn you were born to be now repeat after me i am a unicorn not a twatapus okay don't let these people drag you down okay um keep feeling your life and everything all your um moments and endeavors okay with positive energy okay constantly self-care take care of yourself okay because self-care isn't for pussies and it, it ain't for the for the weak and uh low vibrational either okay it says do something for yourself today and every day make a list of things you can do to treat yourself and break it into categories of free and expensive leave the list somewhere you can see it every single day and get in the fucking habit of spoiling the shit out of you okay I'm going to get like three more and then I'm going to be done. I'm going to let y'all go. Okay. It says you're radiant as fuck. Light. Your light is limitless. Okay. Feel all that badass energy running through you and get ready to shine bright on those motherfuckers like the fucking diamond you are. Shine so bright it burns the fuck out of their eyes, baby. Okay. And please believe it's burning. They're like, it burns. It burns. Oh. She's so popping and fire and sexy. Fuck her. Oh, I hope she dies. She not better than me. Oh, that's so nasty. It's nasty energy. That's why I'm finna go. <laughs> some days good, some days shit. Okay. Not every day is gonna be. Not every day is going to be a good day. It's okay when all you did was make it through. Life can get real fucking heavy sometimes, but just remember, you're a badass motherfucker that's tougher than any shit that life can throw at you, okay? There's nothing anybody can do, okay? Just make sure you stay optimistic as fuck. One more spirit. What's the... Okay. They gave me two, of course. <laughs> um, make sure that you um, be very decisive, okay? You could be getting a very procrastinating, procrastinating energy um, being sent at you, okay? Don't be afraid to take chances. It says sometimes they don't come back, okay? Don't miss the boat. Sometimes they don't come back. Don't miss it trying to entertain these people that we have made it clear to you. Don't give a fuck about you, okay? You were not born to live a mundane life. Once in a while, um, you have to spice it up by putting yourself out there. You never know where a new path will take you or where once where a mischance will strand you, okay? Um, it says, exhale the bullshit. Time to fucking meditate because that shit does wonders. Get into lotus position. Take some deep fucking breaths into your diaphragm and repeat after me. I am the baddest motherfucker in existence. <sighs> fuck all that other shit okay and with that i am done i hope you guys have a fabulous wonderful and amazing and super awesome hater free ass day and i'll see you later